Hello and welcome to the Ultimate Chicken Horse Mod Installation Guide. I'll be showing you how to install both the Even More Players Mod and the Ultimate Outfit Mod. All you have to do is get Tapinex and the mods and then extract them into your game directory. Linux and Mac users require extra steps to install Bepinex. Let's get started. Open the Bepinex download link and download the latest Bepinex version for your system. If you're on Windows, chances are you need the 64 bit version. Go to the Mods Install channel, open the download link to the Even More Players Mod and then download the latest version. Now go to the Cosmetic Mods Install channel, go to the pin message, open the download link to the Ultimate Outfit mod, and then download it. Now that we are done with the downloads, open your UCH game directory by going to Steam library, right clicking on UCH, going to manage, and then clicking on browse local files. Now open the zip files and then click and drag everything inside them into your game directory, and we are done. Weaponex will create its config files once you launch your game. Now when you go into the menu, you will see the more button. This is where you host or join lobbies with 8 online players. You can host lobbies that allow more than 8 online players if you know how P2P works. A couple of mods have to be extracted directly into the Weaponex plugins folder, cause they don't have the folder structure in their zip files. This is also where you can remove individual mods. There are two types of skins, texture skins and outfit skins. The installation process for both are similar. Just put the skins into their respective folders and rename them accordingly. I'll go through the process for both types, starting with texture skins. Open the Google Drive link to find the downloads to all of the skins. Now find a skin to download. Each post should say what type of skin it is. Go to the drive, open the folder for textures and download the skin. Now open the textures folder inside the Webminix folder in your game directory. Move the skin into it and then rename it. Now for outfit skins, I'll be downloading the Hollow Knight skin. Go to the drive, open the outfit skins folder, open the skin folder and then download both the metadata and skin files. Now open the outfits folder in your game directory. Make a new folder. Move the metadata and skin files into the new folder and then rename the folder. And we are done. The mod will replace whatever skin you use for the skin name. I'll also show you how to install the UCH but dumb skins. Open the every folder at once download link. Download the zip file. Open the outfits folder in your game directory. Open the zip file and then drag and drop all the folders into the outfits folder. Every folder is already pre-named so you don't have to bother changing it. Just make sure there aren't any outfits and textures using the same name. Or this will happen. If you don't have all the characters, there's a cheat code you can do to unlock everything. Note that it will prevent you from getting unlock related achievements until your game progress is reset. Rename the winhttp.tll file to disable all Bepinex mods. You can change it back to re enable them. Wah, 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 wah,